What is a privacy statement and why do you need it on your website? If you like to know more, please watch this video. Hello and welcome. My name is Punit and in this video, I am going to help you understand what is a privacy statement, how you can build it and why is it important for your clients. So a privacy statement is a transparency notice or a privacy notice or in simple terms a communication from you to your employees or customers talking about what you do with their personal data, why and how can they get more information. If it is for employees, it is generally published on an intranet and if it is for customers, it is generally published on the website in the footer called privacy notice or privacy statement. It is not a privacy policy. If you want to understand the difference between privacy notice, policy and statement, please watch my video which describes the difference between the three. Here we are talking about a privacy statement. A privacy statement is for individuals who are your employees or customers and telling them about what you do with their personal data. How do you write it? You answer a few basic questions. What personal data you collect? What do you do with that personal data? Why do you need that personal data? Who does this personal data get shared with? What are their rights and how do you respect them? And if they have questions or complaints, how can they ask those questions or raise those complaints? If you answer these questions in a simple plain English language, you would have a privacy statement. Yes, this is to be written in a plain English language so that even a kid can understand. When I say a kid, yeah, not a two year old, maybe around a 10 year old or a 12 year old. So if a kid who's 10 or 12 can understand what is happening with their data, then you have written your privacy statement. It doesn't have to be too long. It doesn't have to be too short. It has to be to the point and explaining them what you do and why. Once you have created it, you put it on your website in the footer. You do not have to ask for acceptance of this privacy statement. You put it on the website, inform them when you are collecting their data, put it with the products, put it with the services as in when people are subscribing to them and inform them that the privacy statement helps them understand what is being done with their data. That is the objective of a privacy statement. So now, why do you need it? Does the law ask for it? Yes, the law asks for it. One of the principles in most privacy laws is called transparency. Transparency means informing the individual about what data is collected, why and what happens with it. And this privacy statement is an instrument, is a document that allows you to demonstrate that privacy. Normally it's best written by business people because they know what is happening with the, with the personal data, why they are collecting it and of course what data is being collected. You do need to involve your legal counsel or a privacy expert or both of them because they would tell you which laws require what so that you can put those requirements in this. And if you need more help, you have questions, do not hesitate to ask me. I can also help you write a privacy statement. So thanks for watching this video. I hope this was useful. Please do click like, do make comments. If you have not subscribed to my channel or these videos, please do subscribe. And thanks for your attention once more and have a great day.